Hello everyone, this is Lamin Sane of Elswat and uh, in this tutorial video I'd like to show you a little neat trick um, that I found that most of the time when I'm working on my projects that I need to be doing and before I actually discovered this method um, I'd give the credit to Chris Coy of CSS Tricks where I found this neat little trick um, I always used to use JavaScript to vertically align elements um, that I didn't know their parent containers dimensions and I'll show you what I mean by that so here we are in code pen this is an online editor and um, since we're not going to be using javascript in this editor i'll just uh, strip that away so we have a parent container which we know is dimensions its width and height the width is 100 percent height is 200 pixels and we have two child elements inside of that and the child elements have a dimension of 50 by 50 and 50 by 100 respectively so let's try to vertically align those two child elements by targeting both of them child one and child two class as you can see here and so if we uncomment this vertical align here as you can see what we want to happen actually doesn't happen something weird happens so let's um let's see what we can do about that so to vertically align these elements we can actually instead of saying this since we know the height of the parent container we can do some math here and just give the, the child elements some margin tops and then they will be vertically aligned but then i'll show you the downside to using that so let's say we um, give the first element a margin top of 75 pixels so that's vertically aligned and let's give the second element a margin top of um <coughs> excuse me of 50 pixels um and then we float the first element float left as you can see now they are both vertically aligned but because we knew the height of the parent container we could we knew which margin top to set the child 1 and child 2 to but imagine we didn't know the height of the um the, the container let's say it was in percentages and we didn't know the actual height of it what could we do well, there is actually another method that I'll just show you right now that would work, that should work with any um, method of um, centering, even though you don't know the height of the parent container. So let's um, delete the margin tops and the float lefts. Okay, so now we're back to where we were. So how to vertically center these two elements when you don't know the parent containers dimension you have to add a pseudo element to actually the parent container the pseudo element is the before pseudo element and then you give it a content of empty string give it a display of inline block and then give it a height of 100 percent and give it a vertical align of middle okay so that's one step then the next second step is um, to give this one avert these two elements these two child elements a vertical align of middle as well so as you can see that did work so that's all we needed to do to vertically align these two child elements if you want you can actually float the first child element but I wouldn't suggest that just to close this little gap float left um apparently that didn't work so as you can see guys floating the child elements does not work and um the reason for that i think is because it goes outside of the um natural flow of the parent container so let's try to actually float this before um let's see what happens Yep, that doesn't work as well. So anyways, um, that was just a little experiment. I actually haven't tried that floating thing before. But yeah, um, now you know how to vertically align uh, child elements inside their parent container. So this was just something short that I wanted to um, do. And uh, I hope it was really helpful. And um, I'll try to post stuff like this. Um, I have been really busy lately so that's why the YouTube tutorials haven't been coming as they were initially but um, I'll try my best to post little stuff like this at least to get something up and going so if I happen to have time I'll be doing them more often but um, as for now this is um, as, as fast as I can go so thanks for watching guys and um, 
yeah, I'll see you sooner on YouTube. Cheers. Bye.